Hello and welcome to our channel. So this is the records in the participant table. If I open a record, as you can see that in the timeline, you could see an email from me to this participant that you are invited in a volleyball trial, Chennai, which is on the date. And hi, Kevin, you are invited and this is the description. So this is the subject and this is the description. How can we achieve it? Via Power Automate Flow. As you can see that these all participant is created on the same time and everyone is getting the same email with their respected name. How can we achieve it via Power Automate Flow? I'm going to show you in this video. So for that, we will go back to our Power uh, Automate Flow. So this is our solution. If I go to Cloud Flow, so this is my uh, Power Automate Flow. If I open it and edit, So send invitation to student or for trial. So when, uh, I'm triggering my flow when this trial table is getting added or modified. Scope is organization level. And uh, here I'm taking date. You could skip this step also. Then I'm getting a uh, record of game because I need to add game. As you can see that whenever I open this any email record, you can see the game here skill on volleyball. So this is the game value I'm getting here. And now I'm getting the row by ID of a user. So because the from I'm sending the email from my uh, ID and then I'm listing all the records of participants whose uh, uh, lookup trial name is equal to our trial, which is just created in this step. And after that, I'm sending them an email with this uh, action, sending an email by V2. So as you can say, see that the two, this is a, this, action will run on a loop. So first we will two, we would add email address for the list rows and then subject you are invited name the output of the trial name and which is on the trial date. And this is the body description. And then uh, I am adding uh, because I had need to show this uh, email message on the timeline. That is why I'm adding this table for email message so that this email message will appear in a timeline. So here I'm adding first two to the, this is the participants so the logical name of uh, that participant entity with the plural name and from your system users. This is also plural name of system user entity and owner value. And uh, because I need to show it on my timeline, I'm adding this section perform a bound action. Table name is email message. Action name is send email and row ID is this. So what I need to show in this email message record, as we can see, if I go there, now you can see in the description, I'm having the same description as of the email I'm sending to direct to the participant. And in the subject field, you could see that subject also here like that. And I, in the issue send, you need to check yes. Now if you save it, I can uh, create a new record of trial. So you could see it again. This time I'm going to create a record just like, uh, uh, let's suppose, uh, cricketing trial for Bangalore. So as soon as you save it, you could see that participant will be added and our power automate flow will run as well and it will send an invitation to all other participants. So click on save. So now as you can see, all the students who lives in Bangalore and their uh, gaming interest is cricket, they all are added. If I open any record, you could see in their timeline, there, uh, there would be sending an email. So open it and mole record. So in the timeline, you could see that email. So you are invited for in a MRF cricket trial in Bangalore, which is on the date, high and mole and everything. So that's it from the video guys. Please like and subscribe.